finally on the net, our first guest reviewer searches out the spaciest sites on the web. Buongiorno, my name is Fiorella Terenzi. I'm a physicist with a specialization in astrophysics. And I am also a musician, a recording artist. I'm very interested in the potential of the internet. A very interesting site which I like to check out constantly is the NASA site. Personally, I like to gather the Hubble Space Telescope almost every day. I like to check which are the new missions they are going to plan. You can preview all these public domain, fantastic computer graphic animation they have, fly by on Venus surface or Mars surface. It's very important to trace back what the ancient civilizations such as Egyptian and Roman thought about the night sky. You have this fantastic goddess. The sky was a feminine concept. It's a place where life is generated. What I really hope to do through my work is to bring back this beauty, is to, to bring back a new aspect the universe, much more romantic, much more easy and simple to understand and a little bit more fun, entertaining. Another fun website is where you can fly your name on Cassini spacecraft. So what you have to do is basically, you know, you have to grab a postcard. What you do, you sign your name and send it to JPL. They are going to scan your signature and through a CD-ROM, boom, it's going to be to the planet Saturn. One of the things I like to do, I like to draw parallel between what's going on in space and what's going on in everyday life. So maybe I can start my astronomical lesson. Why not to talk about a love affair? I have to tell you that when I point my telescope to space, I see exactly the same. I see galaxy that are getting together. They start to fire this superheated material, one across the other galaxy. And that is a galactic communication going on. A website which contains some special sound is the Aurora Borealis sound. Some people say that these sounds are generated by particles that are being accelerated in our magnetosphere. There is also a contribution, they say, from the solar wind. And these are the sound that uh, this aurora seems to emit. This is my home page. I wanted to create a galaxy spot. You can investigate what I'm doing with my music or what's going on with the CD-ROM. This is our solar system, a dynamic class of planets that includes the familiar and the bizarre. My doctoral research in astronomy involved the conversion into sound of radio astronomical radiation coming from distant galaxies. Once the radio telescope collects radio waves from galaxy, I apply my sound synthesis language and through my keyboard I can jam with the galaxy. What I have here today for you are radio waves coming from 180 million light years away from Earth. The name is not very pretty, it's just known as UGC 6697. But uh, listen to what she's singing. <laughs> All the signs will be made available to people through art, through music, through video, computer graphic animation, 3D, internet and web. But please remember, women will be in power, women will be astronomers and astrophysicists, and they will be happy. Well, how did you like it?